Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Cyberpunk 2077 and we need to meet up with uh, a um, nomad named Pan Am. She seems, uh... Well, she doesn't want to work with us. <laughs> Nomads tend not to like city folk, so uh, that's par for the course, I suppose. If she doesn't know us, why would she trust us? Got a job for you, swing by when you have a sec, Nix. So, it's interesting, because CD Projekt Red has never really done a game like this, right? They've done open world with The Witcher, but they've never done driving and first-person shooting before. I'm actually quite impressed with how well they're pulling it off, considering they've never done it before. Credit where credit's due. This game may be buggy, and it may not be perfect, but... Uh, there's definitely an inherent quality to this game that most first developers of a genre wouldn't be able to pull off. Um, another developer who's been able to pull this off recently is probably, um, who went kind of the opposite way, is uh, Ghost of Tsushima's developers. Because they were doing first person shooters that were absolutely wonderful and beautiful, but they went to Ghost of Tsushima and just freaking nailed it. Say goodbye to your favorite bootleg brands, Jumbas. An Arasaka spokesperson has announced efforts that will spell the end to the counterfeit market ah. as we know it. First We're alive. Mega We're okay. Block art, rice wine, Arasake, and niche rock band, Arasaka. Honestly, this announcement might have been the big promo boost these small-time bootleggers have been looking for. Is this our girl? Hey. Pan Am? So you're a V. Where's my car? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. We can help each other. Rogue said so. I might have guessed. All right. Tell me all you know. Fail. And you can run back and tell Rogue to fuck right That one off. forgot to load in. That one too. Hey, come on. Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. <laughs> know where to find the cargo and your car. But you go alone, you won't get him back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? It's on the back of her thing. What does it say? Al... Al Dorados or something like that? Al De Caldos, I think. Al De Caldos. Need to hit a Kangtao transport. Won't be easy. Wanna know I can count on you. Are you out of your goddamn mind? About you or the job? Kangtao's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains? Heard that should help us. Yeah, I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. She's like, I don't we not want to do this job. I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. <laughs> but if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Thought this was mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. 
Without it, only thing I can move is pizza. Maybe. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirt-eating bastard. I will strangle you. <laughs> Nash a chum of yours? He hang you out to dry? Do not call him that. Fine. Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. Straight nipped my truck in the merch. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? Okay. Rocky Ridge. I got your back, girl. Let's, Let's do this. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Want to tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drug. Buzz, hey. Nash is gonna pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Buzz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Buzz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Gave that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. <laughs> Alright, girl. You should try getting one of your own. Respect. Um... Have you not heard of me? Who the hell's boss? I guess not. Won't cause us any grief. Guess street I cred isn't high enough boss yet. Boss is a stand-up guy. Sixth Street. You drive for gang goons. Is that not allowed? Street punks need things moved. I need money like anyone else. So, where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Rogue mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, since Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so. Yes. Okay, strength tarot. Good, let's roll. Get in. Passenger side. We're gonna have a shootout. Nice ride. Lots of space. Practical. Say no more. Please. <laughs> How far is the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. All right, this is going to be the first time I've really head out into the into the country a little bit, huh? How the hell did you land in this mess? I like the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue, do better not to worry what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Rogue's queen of the afterlife. Plays her pawns as she pleases. Did you just call me a pawn? I got a good look at her. I'm one she too. She rises to the top because she reads people. So what if she keeps things to herself? It's a skill in her profession. Well, I think she's a lying, manipulative bitch. She put me together with yeah, that. Yeah, that too. Did you know that? Wait, Nash is Raffin? Yes. He runs with the Rates, the largest Raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? 
Mm -hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams. Sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. Might not have known that side of him. So make me laugh. A fixer of her standing knows. And Rogue probably knows we're talking about her right now. Nash and I had a role to play in her game. Her plan. That's it. Rose yeah, probably. Bitch. That's the truth. I don't spend a lot of time, like, doing the first-person view inside of the cars, but they really have done a nice job with the detail inside of the cars as well. Okay, we're almost hmm. there. We'll gather my guys, then ride to Rocky Ridge. Look what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. Hope our little hothead gets the job done. Good mm -hmm. luck. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Babysitter. Mitch. Two old friends. Hey guys. Hello. What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Now's hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But, but Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear, then be out of your hair. Okay. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again Dude, soon. Dude, my camera we'll is being weird. So jittery. Hey, Pan Am. Oh. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not your concern, friend. Look at that thing. It's like a little mini cannon. Take box. Oh, that What's box. What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. Freaking right, RPG, probably. Let's go. 
How else are we gonna take down an AV? Did you figure out your differences with Soul? When you come back? <sighs> she doesn't even say anything. Panam, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. Pan Am seems pretty cool so far. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. Understandable that she'd be a little bit nervous about us, considering she literally just got ripped off by the last person that Rogue paired her with. So, yeah. The fact that she's uh, a little bit... We can go. Cold towards Hop us in. totally makes sense. I mean, honestly, considering what she's been through, she's been pretty cool, all things considered. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Haven't been so lucky. I see. Yeah, we kind of lost our family. It was, it was Jackie for us. He was the one who was there for us when everything went to shit. Were those two in the army? Scorp and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They were on contract during the last war. Panzer boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. It was supposed to breathe new life into the town. It didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. I drove down I-80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. When you hear it. What's that? I've traveled I-80 many times. The wind times. whistling through boarded up windows. Damn. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang, but with whispers and whimpers. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue? Saul? Your leader? Their leader. Seemed in a hurry to delta the hell out of there. Well, let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see me. What happened? The reason we came to California was because he promised change for the Alda Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. A hell of a promised land. Mm. I wanted something better. Saul's a damned coward. He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Well, damn. Now, where are we? Okay, I'm guessing we maybe were over here somewhere. arrived what do we do we get ready to greet the rapids and we've little time for that we'll need to improvise we should seems like range might be important right now so out first to look for anything that might be useful. Scan the devices in the area. Okay, one of three. Seems to be looking this direction for some reason. 
Are they gonna like aim at each other? No, I don't think so. Okay, these are three ones. Where's the last one? Down Rocky Ridge could be any debtor. Everything's down, nothing works here. Wait, what was the, that was the third one? What? Oh, okay, sure. Well, have you found anything? I got nada, you have an epiphany? The Raffins will roll in after dusk, right? We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. No dice. Nothing's up. I'll cut off. So we plug it back in. Let's check the substation. You got it. Scan the power source. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. Yeah. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? Think flipping on the lights at the intersection will give us the upper hand? Really? First, we don't know how many are coming. My thinking is it'll be a sizable crew. Second, we have to create an opening to get to my car. If they're bunched together, we won't stand a chance. So we give them a little light show at the intersection? Yes. We'll breathe some life into this dusty old town. Soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. looks to be in good shape. 
I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery. Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the Black Rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. If we don't you flip succeed... You the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. If we don't succeed, girl, we don't have a working car anymore. Which gear's got power? Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. Go ahead and save before we do this. Now we wait. Remember, as soon as we see them, you give us power. Raffins will come from where? Any idea? The northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got it. Cover me just in case. Of course. Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them up. Sound good? Sounds great. Which one's hers? That one? Or is it the big one? There be light. Okay, are we supposed to actually attack now? Grab the car, Sean. The driver has it. Oh, with a moment. Fuck. Come back, get line! Have to pick all the oh, I want it to. Take the wheel. All right. Sure, sure. Leave the drive into the pros. It's all yours, girl. This is your ride. Your whip, you get to drive. 
All right. Um, with that, I should probably switch you for one of my machine guns. Action blocked. All right. At last. And she's prime wheels, isn't she? Like a dream, girl. Dreamy indeed. <laughs> I'm surprised you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show. So it was about vengeance. The whole time. The hell you know about me? Either you're not being straight with me, or you don't know what you want. Hard to say which is Just worse. Just listen to me, for fuck's sake! Oh. I know where their little hidey hole is. I'll help her get it. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. I got no qualms. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. Alright, I'm in. Ugh, alright. So where's this hideout? We're doing out? it. A hop and skip away. Thanks, V. What Nash did. I got your back, girl. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it. Know how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him hmm. first. But if they had Takamura. Would you have done it? No doubt. Without skipping a beat. Let's get this over with. Armor integrity analysis. This thing's a powerhouse, isn't it? Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. Let's get him. Okay, let's get a shotgun here. Yeah, those three right now, I think are, are okay. Right of God! Oh, shit. Right. <laughs> 
That doesn't surprise me that I'm full up. <laughs> Epic components from that. That'll be good. We need those. Okay, so technically, we can now use smart uh, guns, right? All right? This is, yeah, no, it's going the right way, okay. I don't really like the precision rifle, if I'm being honest. We're going to get rid of it. Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. One shit clean. Happy. And the Sixth Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched. Was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about Fizz while you were out <laughs> chasing down a vendetta. Fuck! Fucking rogue, man. So, feel any better? Maybe a little. Let's get out of here. <laughs> One bitter cold bitch, that rogue. Thinks she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Thinks she might need a nice strong shock. <laughs> Let's go check up here real quick. I'm sure there's something we can loot. Eddies, baby. All right, BD fifty five BD. Okay, none of those lead to a fifty five. 
Okay, BD, 55, BD. And then what, BD? And BD, cool. Okay, I need to sell some stuff. Okay, not getting that, I guess. Hey, boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Okay. Sixth Street not likely to pull anything? I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Sunset Motel? What's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. Should be fun. We'll skip the ride this time. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. Hey, boss. Pan Am! How's Nash? Doesn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? We work together. Hmm. Change tunes like you change clothes, girl. No need to antagonize. There. First class merch. Mm hmm. What is it? So, everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Um, okay. <laughs> I was being very cautious. It's like, I'm going to wait a little longer. <laughs> Rappin's wiped. Six streets pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. Nash is dead. Congrats. Wonder what you were hoping to get out of that, because I don't think it was just a matter of wounded egos. Even wounded egos wouldn't do something that gunk, hmm? The day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. Is Rogue really implying that she didn't have the right of that? Because, like, she totally had the right of that. <coughs> Come on. Breathe. <coughs> Pull it together, girl. Hello, Noah. Hey. New biz or new friends back there? Take a wild guess. Is everything good with you? Did those bozos come around again? Raffins? Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back, sure enough. This place has seen worse. What can I get you? Brosif. Two of them. So that package for Street, what was it? You didn't peek? Valoperidol. 
drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trading them? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers. Well, here's to that thorn of yours. Thanks for everything, partner. All right, we earned some trust, huh? Another one over here. All right, she's going hard tonight. You've earned it. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. It's one hell of a night, huh? The Alta Caldos. Think you'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but someday. I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? Who would I become if I stayed in Night City? Could always try it out. See who you become in Night City. Except, City doesn't always play fair. Don't know if it's worth sacrificing your friends along the way. You mean Mitch? Scorpion? Come on. Sooner or later, Pan Am, the city will suck you in. Won't need to cut whatever ties you got left to the Aldecaldos. Because the city will do that for you. I guess I should think about it. The Raffins. We done with them? Oh, no. The Shiver Cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. Okay, let's talk about Hellman, man. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Oh, take a swig first. Maybe only one room? Mm hmm. Noah has two twin beds in every room. We'll save some money. <laughs> Not exactly what I meant. Not quite what I had in mind. <laughs> I know. Just glad to have met you, so I thought. Don't worry about it. I'm glad we met too. That was a damn tough day. But still, we pulled through. <laughs> and we'll do it again tomorrow. I like to hear Alright, she's not interested. Are we all right? Fair enough, girl. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I will need a room. Twin beds. Just for tonight. I'll go catch a few winks. She's cool. Oh, I was trying to take one last drink. That's alright. Ugh. I'm starting to feel that stress go away. I'll probably be out as soon as I hit the sack. You had better get some rest too. This is only the beginning. That's the plan. All right. Well, with that, I think we're gonna end today's episode. So thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Have a good one, everybody.